Okay, you see, this is the Logitech G305. This is honestly one of the, the my favorite gaming mice. I've been using this for a long time. I mean, it's not my favorite gaming mouse shape, but it's wireless, it's reasonably priced. It's honestly a pretty good mouse. But I am done with Logitech mice. I am completely done with Logitech mice forever and ever and ever and ever and ever and ever because of its god awful software. Yep, that's right, Logitech G Hub. Logitech G Hub is the spawn of Satan. I hate it. I, I hate every fragment of it. And the only reason I haven't swapped to the Endgame Gear XM1R with far superior software is because it's not wireless. So Endgame Gear, hurry up along. Also, I reviewed this mouse. The, the review I made of this is, is, I think, one of the best reviews I've ever done. So please go check that out if you want to support this rent and say F you to Logitech because screw Logitech because G Hub is literally, and I'm genuinely mean it, literally the spawn of Satan. It's a software straight out from Windows XP era. It crashes every once in a while, and if your computer crashes with it running, it will crash itself, it will take a gun and shoot itself in the head because it is a terrible piece of cold crap. The predecessor to the G-Hub was terrible already, but it was better than this because it at least worked 80% of the time. And this thing crashes and dies once every month, once every couple of weeks, and then it comes up with random crap on the screen and it just doesn't work, it resets the profile on my mouse and the only solution I've owned, the only solution I've ever found is to reinstall G-Hub and it is super difficult to reinstall because when you're uninstalling G-Hub, there's a billion things to click before G-Hub disappears and then, yeah, so the problem here as you can see is that it's it's saying G304 downloading resources and it just, it just won't download, it's been on the screen for a couple hours now and that means that all my profiles have now been deleted deleted from existence for the rest of history. They don't exist anymore and all the profiles that I took, you know, like 10 minutes to set up, gone, gone in an instant. All the button programming that I use every day to edit videos to make all these things, gone. And I have to reinstall it, redo everything just because I want to use a Logitech mouse. As you can tell, I'm extremely flustered. The Logitech G304 is a nice mouse and I really like it. I really want to use it. I spend a lot of money on it, but this software is, Phenomenally crap. Phenomenally, absolutely atrocious. All right, it is the worst piece of code I've ever used because it crashes, it doesn't work, and then it deletes everything that I already had saved. Stop trying to download resources. The resources are already in the computer. If you've worked in the past, Logitech G Hub has always on DRM in the mouse software. Like, what is the point of that? Just save my stuff offline and just work. I don't need updates to my mouse. It's a mouse. All it needs to do is move accurately, click, and have maybe some macro features that, you know, once I set it, I want to forget it. I just need it to work. I don't need always on DRM. I don't need ads in my fucking software. I don't need all these fancy profiles and features and constant firmware updates. I don't need to explore the most popular gaming profile. Look at this. I don't need to explore the most po popular gaming profiles. I don't need to the lighting effects. My mouse doesn't even RGB. Visit the new Logitech G website. You know what G Hub was invented to be? The whole reason G Hub exists is not to add more features, guys. It's not to more, add more features to the Logitech world and Logitech peripherals. They, they made G Hub because it's a walking ad that they can force you to use just because you want to unlock the features of the mouse that you are promised. You have to use this crap software that pushes ads that is full of these random stupid updates just to get the features that you basically paid for with your Logitech products. And because with that, screw you Logitech. Once I find a wireless mouse that I can afford, that I like, I'm never buying a Logitech mouse again, never buying a Logitech product again until they fix this spawn of Satan piece of crap software that is Logitech G Hub. And I'm screaming, but I know a lot of you are going to agree. And if you agree, go and watch my Endgame Gear XM1 review because that is a review of a mouse that isn't from Logitech and I gave it like a 10 out of 10 and I really, really love that mouse and I only wish that it was wireless. And watching that video means you're saying F you to Logitech because you're not watching a video about a Logitech mouse. They've had enough time at the top. I think it's time for them to either fix their crap or die. <clears throat> I know I'm coughing, but I'm vaccinated. Bye.